first thing I, I'm going to do is recruiting, and then uh, I will probably get them in shape. And we need to make sure that all of them are athletes. If we're going to call this a higher level, then they need to become the higher level athletes uh, they're supposed to be. Uh, and then uh, we work on highly uh, work on tactics, and we might have some classroom sessions and. And so we can go over it on the whiteboard and, and um, so they understand exactly what we're going for and all of us are on the same page. And then uh, make sure their technical work is in a higher level. So. I've been doing camps training for the last 20 years in this area. It's been uh, a pleasure, and I get a chance to meet a lot of players that plays at D1, Sounders Academy, they made Sounders, other clubs and professional teams, and, and, and uh, so I have a lot of connections with that in this area. I mean, I'm not only coaching my own club, but I actually train players from other clubs, and, and I work well with most of the major clubs in the state, and, and I've been a trainer for them. So. I, I have access to good players in this area, and I think they will be excited to hear it too. Um, I'm not a favorite for uh, lazy players and players with bad, bad attitudes. They really do not like me, and because I don't allow them to get away with things that they are used to get away with, and and I'm known to be a disciplinarian uh, when it comes to that kind of things. I like to have a good locker room. Everybody gets along. Uh, to me, uh, building a team for a long term starts with a good locker room. So, um, the, you know, I think I think we get the right players for that. And uh, being an outdoor team too, it's going to be much easier for me to recruit.